Bank of America has been incredible. Of the big banks, Bank of America has really stepped forward and done a great job. And then you have the community banks, your smaller banks. And uh, we're already at $3.5 billion going out to uh, incredible people. But that's way ahead of schedule. The SBA and the Treasury are working around the clock, and our banking partners are really incredible. And they're ensuring that the money gets to small businesses as quickly as possible. And then the small business, in turn, take care of employees that they would have had to let go, and now they'll keep them. And that's good. And then they're going to open for business, and they're going to have their employees, and we'll try and get back to where we were. Eventually, we're going to supersede where we were. The energy industry has been especially hard hit in the crisis. This afternoon, I met with Greg Garland of Phillips 66, Dave Hager of Devon Energy, Harold Hamm of Continental Resources, Jeff Hildebrand of Hillcorp Energy, Vicki Holub of Occidental Petroleum, Mike Summers of the American Petroleum Institute, Kelsey Warren of Energy Transfer Partners, Mike Worth of Chevron, and Darren Woods of ExxonMobil. I informed them that we will be making space available in the Strategic Petroleum Reserve to let American producers store surplus oil that can be sold at a later time. Uh, there's a tremendous abundance of oil, uh, primarily because of the virus. The virus has just uh, stopped demand of everything, including oil. So we're working with our great energy companies. These are great companies. They employ tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands of people. And they've kept America really going for a long time. And no big price hikes, no big anything. I mean, they've just kept it going, and now they got hit. But with all the jobs and all of the good that they do, we're going to make sure that they stay in good shape. America is engaged in a historic battle to safeguard the lives of our citizens, our future society. Our greatest weapon is the discipline and determination of every citizen to stay at home and stay healthy for a long time. And we want them to stay healthy for a long time. So stay at home. This is ending. This will end. You'll see some bad things, and then you're going to see some really good things. And uh, it's not going to be too long. We will heal our citizens, and we will care for our neighbors, and we will unleash the full might of the United States of America to vanquish the virus. And with that, I'd like to ask Mike Pence to come up, Vice President, say a few words, and uh, we'll have a couple of other uh, quick talks on a couple of subjects, and we'll take questions. And uh, it's a beautiful Friday in Washington, D.C. And our country is a great place. And we're getting better. We're getting better very quickly. This was artificially induced. We just said, they said, close it down. You have to close it down. We closed it down. And we're healing, and we're going to get it better fast. So, 